So let me show you the easiest way to get rid of track changes and comments in your Word document. And you've all seen it before, so when we look down the Word document, we've got some comments here, we've got some track changes, and sometimes we just can't get rid of them. So I'm going to show you how. Now I'm going to first of all show you what not to do. So on the review tab, just have a look up here, and what a lot of people do, I'm just going to mark this for you, sorry the cat has just walked across the screen there. Uh, here we go, so they, can you see there, it says on the review tab, all marker. And what some people think you need to do is just change it from all markup to no markup. And on the face of it, it looks like everything's disappeared. There's no headings, there's, there's no comments, there's no track changes. But they're still there, they're still there underneath. So let's change it back to all markup and you'll see, you can still see them. There we go, there's my comment, here's my track changes. Now you can get around it by in the track changes, accepting and rejecting the comments over here. You could also get around it by deleting the comments. But there's still the one where you might miss something. So I'm going to show you the quickest way to get rid of all these comments. When, when you're happy with them, obviously make sure you're happy with these comments first, you're happy with the deletions and the insertions, but the quickest way. Um, so if you like this content don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and let me go and show you how to get rid of this so let's go to the file menu and we're going to go down to info and then we're going to go to check for issues and inspect now a little tip here if you use powerpoint you can also do this in powerpoint and one of the things that inspects if you look at the top of here is for comments revisions and versions and that's what we want there are also other things it's looking for, I tend to leave these ticked because they're actually quite useful. It would pick up things like if you've got any watermarks in there, maybe you've got a watermark on there saying draft, so I'd leave that in there as well. So let's choose inspect and it will work through the document. So now it's found some and all I need to do, don't have to faff around with track changes, I just do remove all. Um, I can also remove the personal information. So when you create a document, it will store information about the um, computer, the start that's created that document. So I could remove that and it wouldn't remember the author or anything like that. So let's choose reinspect. All oh, good. And we're going to close that and we're just going to go back to the original document, have a look. So there we go. So no comments. And let's just check my, there we go. There's my, one of my change track changes that I inserted so that's worked so it looks like all by doing that by going to file info check for issues inspect and that will remove all the comments or the track changes and you haven't got to worry about them being there when you send out the final version give it a go and I hope this helps thanks for watching bye bye